Good morning, guys. Today's a good one. We are taking the camper over to Slambasta to have the hydro installed. I'm buzzing about this, but that's kind of overshadowed with the fact the van's running like crap, and I don't know why. And if you can see, I got to ride my motorbike home, and it's icy and snowy. So the sooner I get there, the sooner I can have a cup of tea, get warm and bomb it home as fast as I can. Let's go. There we are, we're at Ambassador. I made it. Uh, the van's sounding a bit loud and shitty, so we had a little look in the engine bay and it seems that like I've got a real leaky bad injector, so Dennis is gonna sort that. Got the bike out, and then I'm just gonna leave it with them, get the hydro fitted. I am gonna leave them with the camera. Oh, sorry. I am gonna leave them with the camera um, so they can film the install. And then when I get back, we are gonna put an another kit on the bench and we will explain with my old kit what's different and why we're doing it and how it's uprated so i'll leave the camera with these guys and check back in with you in a week oh i'm excited Right then, back up at Slambassador a week later. Absolutely freezing, so I've just ridden the motorbike here. It's uh, two degrees, sad 90 on the motorway. Absolutely freezing, but the van is done and it looks incredible. Let's go take a look. So here it is, done a bit of work on the front to get that subframe slam in. Watch this lift. That is insane. <laughs> so we've got the full kit on and then if we go around the back we fit the accumulators in there so we've got this new box that Den's just had made solenoids in there and the accumulators in the top really really neat install and because one side of my van's heavier than the other you can gas those accumulators more than the other side so it always lifts right sorry if i'm shivering a little bit i'm absolutely freezing but i suppose we should take it out for a drive and see how it is Struggle. It doesn't like it when it's cold. I think I need to bleed the clutch. <laughs> Double pump it. It goes so high. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I need one. A pheasant. I can't help myself. <laughs> Hey. 
Look, we go over the bumps. There's, there's like no bump there. No. It's mad, isn't it? Den was aiming at bumps last time. Look. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, maybe we're a bit low for that. <laughs> Day difference. It does corner flat to be fair. Yeah. It's so quiet the pump. Though. It's lush in it. Yeah. It raises so quick. Oh my god, it's mad. load of the Slambaster kits on the bench I just thought I'd talk you through it so these are the new pumps and this is the old one so they're just a lot more powerful but to go with the more powerful pump you've got these bigger stronger rams as you can see this is the old one I've got and it's a sealed unit the new ones are you can literally take that top off in situ and for eight quid redo all your bushes inside which is really good because they do wear out and then this is the old system my crappy homemade box but you've got springs and the fluid goes through there and then this is your suspension whereas a slambaster kit uses accumulators <clears throat> which is like a gas filled gusset inside that the the hydro fluid has to push through so you can gas it to the weight of your van um, and the higher you go with the van the gas never changes in there whereas the higher you go with the van with these the more compressed your springs are the harder your ride is so you have to find like a good ride height with the old kit, whereas this, I can drive it at any height I want and the ride will be the same. And it just looks really classy. So this is the first kit they did, with the, which looks nice, but they've just had these boxes made, which are, they've all got holes in and threaded, so all the stuff just bolts straight into there. So that is literally it, that lines and a pump and some rams, real nice clean setup. Um, when I get the van home, I'll probably take two of the wheels off and show you guys the rams and how it's all fitted. So just say goodbye to Dennis and Tony at Slambasta. Massive thank you for them to fit in this kit. It's so good. So to give it a road trip on the way home and see how it performs. Oh man, I can't wait for this. It's so good. So I've just pulled in at Poplar Services to get some fuel and this, honestly, this van drives so much better. So you don't have to swerve for potholes or anything on the motorway now, it just swallows them up, which is really good. So we'll get the van home now. Uh, the engine's not sounding too good. I've got a leaky injector, so I'm hoping it's just that. It's a little bit bangy. So hopefully I'll get home. If not, you'll be, uh, we'll be recording an RAC call out. Let's get this bloody thing home and have a look. So I've just pulled back up on the drive now. Uh, the van did make it home, which is good. I think I've got a really bad leaky injector, so I'm gonna put some new seals in those tomorrow. Uh, yeah, really, really happy that I got this this uh, Slambaster kit fitted to the van. It's so good. Um, I know these video, this video, like I didn't really film the drive in there or back very much, um, but I was just a bit paranoid about the engine and stressing a little bit. But what I am gonna do, 
jack it up on axle stands, take the wheels off, and I'll give you a full run through of where you'll put the parts, what the parts do. Because um, hydro is fittable yourself, you can do it. I did my first one. So, and just explain the kit really more in depth. Um, sorry, I'm out of breath. I've just pulled that bloody motorbike out the back, it weighs a ton. So, yeah, um, if you're liking the videos, I know they're all a little bit all over the place at the moment but the, uh, the whole country is all over the place at the moment. So we're trying to get out what we can and during you know, video what we're up to. We filmed a podcast last night, that's gonna be a good one. And there's a little cheeky bonus at the end, so if you watch it all the way through. Um, please remember to like and subscribe to the channel. It's free and it gets you notifications on when our new content comes out. And until the next one, guys, see you later. Nice one.